So let's now go for this Sandy Dunes place. Abjad Dunes. Sure. Sounds a, a good wheeze, I guess. Welcome to Abjad Dunes. Uh, this place is, is, is actually feeling quite large. Pretty decent, really. Wow, there's lots of people up in this bitch. So let's see what this person wants, because I assume this person wants something. No! This person doesn't want anything. He's just gonna. Nomads are just wandering around. Right, hello, you. You seem very out of place. I need to help. I need to help my kingdom with this shape changing potion. But I need three more venomous ingredients. Here's Cobra Commander. Uh, Cobra. Cool. Cool Commander! I thought Cobra was going to be the word that you didn't quite get, but okay. Put the cool Commander into the pot, along with a spider! Um, uh. Jet Oak vi Vinegar. I was looking for a jug of vinegar, but whatever. Um, some chips. They, they are not chips. This is not America. This is Egypt. A snake. Justin Bieber. Beaver. Judging Beaver. <laughs> Perry doesn't like you. I think that just um, judging Beaver was very venomous. A platypus, which is actually venomous. Oh, oh God! Everything went crazy. Everything's gone mental. Jeez, what happened to you, mate? Skilly tall vizier. What the fuck happened? Things went absolutely insane. <laughs> Good lord. Right, okay, let's let's be serious for a second. Have I broken this? Have I broken it by being a dick? No, no, it's still it's still fine. I'm gonna let that uh, go fine. Right, okay, fine. Here's some poison. A scorpion! Get over here! And now suddenly he's a snake. Don't know what they liked on that, but I just threw a bunch of shit in there and it really worked out. Is this is that my snake or Okay. I, I need to try and figure out what's going on. Right, but let's start with this person. Uh, Achilles seems to be catching up to the tortoise, but he can't catch him. If only I could measure this race. What? I don't know what he, I don't know what the fuck she's talking about. The snake just ate the tortoise. Restart. Right, okay, so now that we don't have a snake running around, which apparently was mine, it's funny how long that actually went back and forward without the tortoise getting eaten. So apparently, I think what we need to do to this guy, oops, no, not me, this guy, this guy, they catch him right now, he's right next to you. Right next to him. Uh, 
Sorry, what is going on? He's, so he's not trying to catch him. Is she looking for a stopwatch? Yes! That is exactly what she wanted. I thought uh, he actually wants to catch him, but apparently not. Right, what's up next? This guy, which who looks like he's got a turban on, but he's also got another hat on. Who's this? He's a stonemason. I suppose the hat really does help with the sun. Just saying. Uh, I can't carve a monument to the pharaoh with just my bare hands. Yeah, you can't. Why did you come to make a monument without any stuff? Bad form, dude. Bad form. I'll just have to step in. As always. I do like to do exactly the same things, but I just like this idea of using a jackhammer. Hmm. You know, that, that would take some skill to do with a jackhammer. It's like, skill. Is that, is that, is that what's done here? Right, cool. Moving on. Why is there a mime? Why is there always a mime? In the middle of... Need, I need to find a sandworm. They're attracted to sound. But you're mime so you don't... Yeah, okay. Hmm. I know what I can do! Now you're a loud mime! I think I just, uh... uh Timesed by zero. Next up, boom box. Oh yeah! Wow! Oh, good lord! What is? What the fuck is this? Oh, it's a Dune reference. How amusing! Wow, you're looking quite evil, my good man. So apparently, I'm in. I'm a desert raid raider now. Protect the village from the marauding bandit. Why am I talking to a bandit to stop him from... Who knows? Let's just do it. Okay. She ran away and went moo ha ha ha. Bandit Embassy tells you that her gang is coming to raid the village crops. Maxwell will need to recruit help. Why would she do that? Why would she just not attack? That makes no sense. Okay, let's find out what I'm doing next first. Recruit someone to defend our village! Sure. It's a mecha death nice giant! Oh, God. Right, um, Deathly, Macho, Death Giant. Yeah, um, this Mecha Death Giant, he's just about to kill me. You can see it in his eyes. You actually gonna kill anyone? He's not gonna kill anyone. Superb. Now the engineer has come to the villagers' aid. Help him by fill, building the fortifications for the town. Are you, are you really not going to kill anyone? The nice stood. Fantastic. Huge wall! Well, they, well they're not getting through that. Hmm. I feel the quaintness of the town has now been a bit ruined. Just to say. Next, teach the villagers how to fight. I barely know how to fight. How am I going to teach them? Oh, recruit someone who can instruct them. I really should read the moron before. I mean, I'm sure the, the giant could do that. A kung fu master. A kingly master. Hey, <laughs> it did work. 
Not only can can he fight, he's also a king. He's the king of fighters. <gasps> he wins that game. Now recruit someone who can infiltrate the enemy camp and spy on them. Hey. They, oh. Oh, I got a two for. Two for one. Finally, prepare Maxwell with a weapon. See, I would, I would just, I would do a flamethrower because I like flamethrowers, but he's just going to torch everybody and kill them all, and that'd be the end of it. So no, I'm not going to do that. What will I give them? A gerbil! Oh, sorry, sorry. That was, that was a bit stupid. <laughs> oh, he's eating the plants. No. No! That's a bad gerbil. Bad gerbil. Baby, as I was saying, that was that was kind of stupid. Now he's a sharp gerbil. Now I can kill people with my gerbil. It's a gerbil of death. No. Okay. He's a sharp, deadly gerbil. Now this gerbil thing's just not working for me. It's really not. Okay, massive sword. Why am I wor- I'm worried about the gerbil now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm worried about the fucking gerbil. Oh good lord! Why is everyone killing each other? Oh, right. Is that fine? Is that everyone? Yes! Yes! I was a bit worried that they were gonna murder each other because I think that's where that was going. <laughs> but I got my star right and I'm legging it. Legging it. So, we've got four more. Let's see if this one. My statue is a bit lifeless. Won't you help? Why do they want me to, to, to turn things alive? How much good is it going to be if I make this statue alive? All that's going to happen, dude, is it's going to kill you. That's what happened. Have you not seen horror movies? I want a star right. Give me a. How about if I turn into an angel? No, I've created an angel. Really not what I was going for. So I'm going to turn that into, hold on, turn that into an angel. Oh, he buggered off. So he has his scarpet. Well, that, that was handy, right? Why are you all pissed off? Why is this, why is this guy so annoyed? Why are you annoyed? Help me summon a plague to to scare off this grave robber. Bit of overkill, I think. <laughs> Let's create a plague to take rid of get rid of one guy. It's a plague of niceness. It's a plague of nieces. Uh, oily, a pagan oily niece. Who's a guy? What in the fuck? Yep, pagan oily niece. That is definitely a guy. It's a guy niece. Fine. Now he's red and small. It's a plague of red and smallness. Red, small, and sick. That do you? What mm. the fuck? What the fuck do you? Oh, what's going on here? Why is this? Why is the angel suddenly walking down going, hmm, what the fuck are you doing? Give me something to plague. To scare off this grave robber. 
No! Why? What's going on? Right, hold on. Well, he's a burning bush. How about that? I don't know. How about spell book? What does this guy want? What does this guy want? Is there another grave robber? No. This is this is gonna it's gonna be one of those ones, isn't it? It's gonna be one of those ones. Okay, I'm gonna go over here and interact. And now there's a brush. Right, okay. Now he's a nice grave robber. Why is the grave robber so into the uh, angel? Help me summon a plague to scare off this grave robber. Locusts? He's a locust. I see, so you were just looking for one of the plagues. Well, now there's loads of locusts. Are ya happy? Now there's less locusts. Now there's just one locust. That worked out quite well. Okay, how about you? Why is there a sculptor just randomly over here? Right, what's going on over... Oh. Nope, that's uh, changing place. So, where am I? I are confused. So now I need two more. Oh, there's two up here. Right. There's actually one up there. Right, okay. Let's go up there. Where's my jetpack? Oh, good lord, they keep losing my jetpack. I'll take my spell book as well, because why the fuck not? Hello, Altair. What it looks like. Help me solve this riddle. What goes on four legs in the morning, two at midday, and three in the evening? I know the answer. I can't come up with something funny. It's a guy. It's a man. Here's a guy. Basically, uh, what, what they're trying to say is... When uh, it's life, you know, when you're when you're a baby, you want four legs. When you're a mat, when you're like a adult, um, you walk around on two legs. When you're an old person, you've got a cane, so three legs. That's what they're trying to say. It's a bit shit. So lastly. What the fuck is going on here? What is this? Airway pressure unit. No, no, I don't know what the connection is. Who wants to help? This guy. My weather changing device broke. Help me impress the meteorologist by creating some unlikely weather. Okay. Dog poor rain. I don't know what dog poor is. I don't know. Whatever. Moving on. Well, See, you jump, you. and that's the end of it. Stop dancing on my face! That is not against. That's against the rules. Now eat my. Uh, knee in your face. Who would make this? Well, I want to meet them. I'm going to fucking kill them. Right. <laughs>